Hi, my name is Mayhem Star. Welcome to Kitty Card 64. This is charming, reminds me of Mario Kart. Player 2 not detected, 1 2 input memory. Connect remote to port to play split screen. Single player. This is charming. What happened to the finish line? Why has it kind of collapsed? That's alright. We should be fine. Let's go this way. Wait. Why are you letting me go this way? Am I breaking the game? I literally just drove through your barricade. Why are there so many... Why are there so many twists and turns? As in like, why is there a junction in a racing game? It should just be a straight line, no? What's this? Turn around. Can I go through here? I don't really understand my objective. Why is this happening? Um... What's this? Can I interact with you? Do I have to drive over you? How do I interact? Oh, Q to check behind me. That's useful, I guess. Oh, press E. Okay. There's a fat sunflower that's thinking about jumping off a cliff. Is that what you're trying to say? Is that us? We... Okay, I guess we live. But what about the race? I'm not racing? I, I mean, I'm quite a competitive individual, but... Where's the race? Let's follow the lines... Sorry, follow the arrows for now. Okay, so I think the music gets louder when we're closer towards the actual racetrack, so let's follow it first. It's on this side here. Lap 1? No. Surely I'm missing something. So you want me to go off the beaten track? Where do you want me to go? Oh, that's my arrow! Okay. I understand now, that little yellow arrow is us. Let's travel really far away. Oh, this is a huge map. It's huge. Okay, so it spans the entire screen. What's this? Don't go off the edge. Oh, that's the edge. We're going. Goodbye. To freedom. What? Is this the shit bit? Where is this? Oh, okay, I think I understand. There's a clue somewhere which tells me what to do. We're sinking. We're sinking. Oh lord, we're sinking. What happens if we do sink? Let's find out. Oh, the music gets louder as we sink deeper. Did we die? I like this. This is cool. I don't know what the story is, I don't know what it's implying, but this is epic. Hey, who are you? Our desert's supposed to be hot. Yes, it can be cold at night. I can't feel anything at all. Because you're standing in the water? Question mark. Or maybe you're just so numb to your surroundings. You've been here for so long, you've grown accustomed to the heat. But more importantly, where are we? And why are we here? It's almost as if we fell through one map to another map. Is that what it's implying? 
I'm gonna follow this track for a while, give me a second. And at no point in time have we actually finished. Is this on purpose? Oh no, this is on purpose, but def uh, definitely. For a second I thought it might be um, my computer, and I was like, no, can't be my computer, no way. Are we gonna finish a lap? Nope, we're not. Oh, you're dead. I can feel something now. You can? Really? I figured you'd be dead. You wouldn't be able to feel anything then. Nothing behind us? Am I supposed to keep going? The music stopped. Well, at least the music stopped, thank god. It's getting on my nerves. I'm still concerned, like we haven't even completed a single lap. Off the edge we go. What the hell? You wanna talk to me or something? I'm so confused. Nothing behind this yet? I guess not. Can I run over your head? Nope, I guess not. I'm trying to listen for sound cues to see if there's anything out there, but I can't hear anything. You block my exit there. Block there. Okay, so there's a path. This way. Nothing behind this. That's good. Hey, we don't have a mini-map anymore. So no mini-map, no arrow. Uh, this way. Is the sound getting worse? Louder? More intense? Oh, it stopped. Am I supposed to collapse all these blocks? Because it kind of feels like it. Oh, here. Is this out? Test. There's a level above us. How do we get up there? Is there a way up? Sounds like, uh, sounds like shuffling. I can't quite tell. I'm trying to think up of funny things to say, but I really can't, because it's just so unbelievably random. Anyway, off the side we go. Yippee-ki-yay. Oh, what does this say? Cool. Galato? Map 006 not found. Cool. Cool cat. Elations. Cool cat elations. Cog. Cog. Lat. What? Can I pop this? I can. Okay. Let's go around popping a bunch of balloons. Do we have to pop all of them? Is there an expectation? Oh, that's a person. Or someone's soul, perhaps. 21 to pop. Okay. We can do this. Sorry, kid. Uh, there's a man as well. I thought this was a kid's game. Why is there a man? Whoop. 
and we pop. Hey, there's stuff behind us. What's this way? Hey, something to talk to. Okay, screw that. Guess we can't talk to you. Not really. Hey, what's that? <laughs> no, it's not you. Go away, I'm not interested in you. I'm interested in this entity, whatever that is. Why is it that I can honk a horn now? Every time I press E. When I pressed E before, it was just to interact. Why can I honk a horn now? I'm going to go this way. Let me just three-point turn the car. What's down here? Hmm. Someone following us. Hey, something here to read. Paper. Okay. That's the cat that we met, but... We've already spoken to him. Does this... Go around? Well, that better. Because we need to talk to that cat, I think. Oh hey, who are you? Ow. Okay, you are doing me no favors. If you have a problem, say it in English. Or French, or just any intelligible human language that would do. Have we been here? Okay, here we go. There's another down. Oop. Hello? Nope. I guess you still don't want to talk to me. Am I not lovable enough? Am I the cause of all this despair? How will I know? Hey, look! Geronimo? There we go. No, great. Endless nothing. Is that blood? Oh, an arrow. Okay, we go this way. I'm assuming it's telling us to go forward and just follow the direction of the arrow. Is this a cave? An entrance way? It is. Let me just check this real quick. Where does this arrow point? Yep, okay. We go down here. I think there's some sort of motif going on where we're just traveling deeper and deeper down. But deeper where? Follow this arrow.
Mm-hmm. This one says this way, so we go down this way. Is there another arrow on this end over here? Nope. Well, uh, we'll just follow the arrows on the ground. Hey, the finish line! That's all I care about! What's going on? Oh! Our ties got popped. We, we can't move. What the fuck are you? What, you don't want us finishing the race? Is this it? That's kind of mean. You could have at least let us cross the finish line. Thank you. Great. What do you want me to do? I'm just gonna sit here and wait for the sequence to be over. Oh, and it closes. Alright. So, that was Kitty Card 64. So, here's my kind of thing. I have never played a game like this before. I don't know if I'm supposed to approach this game with certain expectations as a first time player of this kind of quote unquote horror genre. All I do know is that it's probably like an exploration. Check out these really glitched out retro versions of an old game. That's the kind of like the creepy aspect of it. But I don't know what that man with the hammer that bashes us over the head has anything to do with the encompassing atmospheric story, the concept. I mean, it would have been better if we got chased, but yeah, no, you know what? It would have been better if we got chased. Maybe it would make more sense to me. Actually, no, it wouldn't make any sense at all. But at least I would have some sort of uh, climax to a point, you know what I mean? Some sort of climax that would make you run towards the finish line and then the kitty will be like, Yay, we got to the finish line, and then maybe you pop out tires then. But for some reason, the story or the flow of the game has decided to pop out tires before we get to the finish line, which is a bit underwhelming. With regards to gameplay, I've got no issues with that. With regards to other secrets that I could have found, I would have had no clue. I think I found everything I needed to know. Um, in terms of depth, there's not much to it besides the fact that we keep going down. So if you want to consider that, if you want to consider the fact that we keep going down depth, then I guess there's depth. Well, I don't know. I think it was just a unsettling experience and that's all it's supposed to be. My name is Mayhem Star and I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Bye.